ladies and gentlemen, the Division 2. Look at them, Division 2. D2, that's not the best. <laughs> that's, that's on the one. <laughs> so, so, so imagine the best D1 and then D2, three on three, champions, PCY. I don't think it's fair to say that, like, we came fifth overall. We, no, we didn't. <laughs> well, okay. So, to, 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 well, technically, we came fifth, but in, I in, don't have any. in a perfect I'm world, ten. fifth I'm always ten. gets yeah. silver. Yo. Hey, that's technically that's mediocre. That's 50%. Same with Carl's sex tape. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get the intro out of the way before you start roasting me. All right, so fifth place, which in my mind is pretty much finals. You're still in the playoffs. We won anyway. <laughs> But we got wild card into the finals and um, and then we won the finals. So of Division Two. Of Division Two, um, <laughs> which is I mean, if if you're a, if you're a Division Two college player, Jamal, are you still a good player? Technically, could you still make it to the NBA? Technically. Technically. <laughs> well, I'll take technically. Carl, can you still make it to the NBA? Um, I mean, not with these knees. <laughs> let the record show my knees. But anyway, <laughs> man, welcome, still welcome to um, episode 45 of the I Want to Beat LeBron James podcast, episode 2 with video and fucking colour. And Welcome back, because if you're watching this, this, it means you probably watched another one. Bang. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> That's normally how it works. When, when somebody comes and you haven't met them, you're always like, hey, good to see you again. Hey, or also, welcome to all the new viewers. Unless you're a creepy Italian man, then that's the general green. Is that what you want? Is that what you want to watch? Right, uh, anyway, we got it on my on my state on my left here. In my immediate left is our starting power forward slash centre. Because um, in a three on three, I've played two positions. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we got I feel my, like I can small forward. <laughs> my uh, foul champion um, Jamal Graham is in the house. What's up? What's up? I'm good. I'm good. And you guys? Nice. Not much, baby. Uh, what, what about going to a face for making small talk during the pod? Uh, then we got Evan Deverich, which is, uh, I was about to say, we give them coach. We give them yeah. the title. I'd say yeah. so. I mean, he was in the huddles. I was supportive. He was, he was, yeah. was photographer uh, slash uh, director. Video photographer. Slash Steve Jabby. Slash uh, him. Um, He's the guy in the replay uh, center. And, and Bill, yeah, and Bill Murray in Space Jam. I'm Bill Murray and Yeah, yeah that's exactly who I am. I was supposed to come in for the final second. Let's, let's think was, about this. Okay. I was gonna root it, man. Where are your shoes? Can you? Can you yeah, I got vans. I got vans. Right. I slip on vans. So he had he had slip on vans, which are even they got worse ankle sports than the Kobe fucking eight. So yeah, you're asking, you're, no ankle support. You're asking to break yourself at that point. It goes big baller brand zero one twos. <laughs> it goes vans, and then it goes Kobe's yeah. in terms of ankle protection. <laughs> 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 so he wasn't to come in, but we were like in terms. Well, for the start, Eden, rest in peace, Eden, could it start? It was me, Jamal, it was, it was actually uh, Will. Well, tell me, tell me your nickname. Oh, my nickname? Yeah. Old man gets paid. Old man gets paid. I was not wise. I was the great white hope. Kawhi, it's not poor man gets paid. That's not quite. That's his say. That's his phrase. Oh, that's what he says. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Come on, I know my basketball. But I mean, <laughs> it's like it's also not anything. It's the longest nickname ever, so it shouldn't be. <laughs> Which people don't know that you don't know basketball. Know so much about basketball. Yo, well, Evan is actually ed- editing our highlights at the moment. We've yeah. watched more amateur basketball oh than anybody God. in the world. So many misses. But just so many misses. <laughs> but, but, uh, but Evan was going to come in the last game and we kind of just forgot and we did want, I mean, we needed a win. And then we were like, after Eden broke, it, well, we thought he just get his knuckle, came back, I'll show you the x ray, get the x ray off. For the cam, uh, 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 the photo. Send it to me. Thing. I'll put it right. Uh, <laughs> what are you talking right about? Perfect. We'll put it right here. Well, let me just right turn my phone around. <laughs> yes, that's what it works. But that I forgot we could edit it in. So apparently he's broke his hand, and they didn't even have ice to give him. <laughs> they, they, they gave him two fucking what? What were they? Icy, icy pops, pops, and then I ate the icy pops. <laughs> and then Evan ate the icy pops anyway. <laughs> I was on a sugar high. I would have played so much basketball. Like it didn't help with his swollenness, but it helped with Evan's low blood sugar. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> if he didn't have those icy pumps, it would be written oh, off. Yo, that actually was for real though, man. That was hard to look at. Yeah, that's a broken finger. He drove Holy after God. it with that. You know he was crying. What the specifically with that hand? <laughs> he, tried, he, tried, he tried. He put it out this window to indicate someone else. <laughs> 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 Did you actually see the play? Oh. Did you actually see what happened when he broke us? Did they, was it coming down on a rebound or something or something? I like haven't it? edited that yet. I Do you have the, the footage? I have the footage. Of course I have the footage. I was on the side. I, I was subbed out. And then um, 
I remember him, I think he was like, it must have been on the rebound because he got his finger pulled back. I yeah, think. yeah. And then I just remember him coming out and just holding his hand, being like, and I was like, all right, I'm going to jump back in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it, he literally ran like it was like, remember when Kobe did it and he just clicked it straight <laughs> back in? And then, oh. they, and then they talk about, I think it was Ben Valentunis. It, it happened the same thing happened to Valentunis and he's just running like a baby. He's like, ah! And Kobe just takes it on the chin. The guy just says, you see the guy counts one, two, and he got in. Instead of doing it on three, he does it on two. Oh. <laughs> just to fuck, and then Kobe, and then he taps Kobe on the head and he goes straight back in the game. Hey, the thing is like, crazy. Well, you, you can't compare you can't anyone to Kobe. That's true, to be honest. <laughs> Especially Valentinus. <laughs> Especially Valentinus. Um, Valentinus. Uh, Toronto Raptors. Raptors. So that, and, yo, is Marcus Gasol gone to Barcelona? No, there was talks that he was heading to Barcelona, but that was just rumors. So he might stay with the Raptors for a bit. Ah, okay. Or at least in the NBA. I mean, like, I guess we'll get to basketball talk at some point, but I would rather have Sergio Barker than Marcus Gasol. I mean, as center, sure. a starting center. Yeah. For his basketball play or for his YouTube videos? Well, uh, for both. Yeah. <laughs> cooking in scarves. <laughs> I don't want to eat anything he's cooking. I give it that much. <laughs> what? Too spicy? Um, too much war festival, man. <laughs> oh, oh you gotta <laughs> try it. Don't knock it. <laughs> I ain't Roman. <laughs> okay. No, but I, like really, because changing back to me is a power forward. No, that's a true position. Yeah, but the game's small now. Yeah, but what I'm yeah. saying, I'd rather have, I'd rather have Marcus Ol. Start really over a backer. See, I would rather have. Okay, let's say you start back as power forward, but like. Well, you can't because you got spicy P. Well, he can play small. Yeah, because an OB, it doesn't really matter with an OB. Like, yeah, he's he more defensive than Bucket. But right, even, yeah. even if you start a backer and then have a big man in center, like, it doesn't necessarily have to have the pay package that Marcus All gets because his output isn't worth the amount he was making. Especially yeah, yeah. His last playoffs as well. This playoffs it wasn't one. Oh, no, no, no. Well, he didn't play this, didn't play this playoffs? Yeah, he played. Yeah. See, that's how fucking shitty one. <laughs> I didn't even know. Well, Spicy didn't really play. Well, Spicy is my first star, and now we know he's still a second star. Yeah. You know what I mean? He's not, he, he, like, he'll either need to make that leap, and he will, or he, or he just won't. I mean, well, he's he, in the regular so. season, he was phenomenal, and they had more wins than they had with Leonard this year. No, they had the same, I think, in the end, didn't they? No, no, no. In the regular season, they had more wins than hmm. they did last year. And even with a shortened season? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's crazy. But that's because, obviously, load management last year. Yeah. Well, I was coming back from a weird injury, too. Yeah. Because mm-hmm. like, Quite well, didn't really play in the season. And like, he just picked it up yeah. in the playoffs. And they didn't have Freddie playing like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They also didn't have Lowry playing like that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I think Larry did. Oh, he, he was still an all star, wasn't he? I think. I mean, he's still an all star, but yeah. like this, this year he really stepped it up. Oh yeah, like, yeah. Well, after getting that contract as well, you know what I mean? Like you got paid the bag, but he deserved it at that point. Of course, you know I mean, mean, like that's just long overdue, really. Oh man, they're gonna build a statue of him on top of the CN Tower. Yeah. But then, so if if you it's ripped to Rosen. If Giannis goes to the Raptors, which he's fucking not gonna do. Yes, he is. Why would you leave Milwaukee for an even fucking colder place? That doesn't make sense when you go. Okay, the first off, man. Canada gets warm in the summer, <laughs> and they don't play, and he's not going to be there during the summer. It's <laughs> the off season, so why would he? Why would he? He just vacation in Toronto. And yeah, they, they, look, they'll, they'll sell way more merch. Like you're not playing for Toronto, you're playing for Canada at that point. What? Why would he go to Toronto over the heat for the management? But. But, but the then you'd go for the, the heat because you got Pat Riley. It's mad. I mean, like the culture is a winning root, culture. You don't hear root. How do you say that? You say you You say whatever. You say. Yeah. Yeah. You say. You say Algeri. Yes. Thank yeah. You. Yeah. Thank you. He. Usai. Can we put it? We might have to write it. At the bottom. <laughs> yeah, we'll put it at the bottom. How much it's stuff are you asking me to do? You. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to edit and be it. If you can just edit your stuff out as well. <laughs> <laughs> Masai Hujeri, that's it. Thank you. Masai Hujeri. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna cut out anything you say funny. (laughs) (laughs) Fuck yeah. (laughs) Just crickets. Yeah. But he has created a really good culture um, in Toronto. Mm. But that. But in Canada? Yes, in Canada. Yeah, because he's doing the Canada basketball team as well, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. But that heat culture, influenced by Pat Riley, has been around since the early 2000s. It's very true. And it's why so many players that want to work hard flourish. And that's why they have so many players that... Actually, Toronto, too. They have so many players that were undrafted or lower in the drafts that have come through and proved themselves. Yeah, yeah. 
Because like I will Miami Heat like they have weekly like they do more physicals, more like training yeah. than any other team. Like they have weekly physicals where they have to have so much body fat. So really? he, even if yeah. you're Jimmy Butler and he didn't pass it, Pat Riley doesn't give a shit. Maybe not in the finals, he wouldn't pull him out. But yeah. regular season, he'd be like, yeah, fuck you off the team until you get back in it. Yeah. You know what mm-hmm. I mean? Dion Waiters was their best player before Jimmy Butler went there, but he just he just messed around too much. So oh, Dion like, Waiters was injuries too. Yeah, of course. But I mean, still, like it's not like... Like, they paid him the bag, and then same with Whiteside, they paid him, they wanted yeah. him to be, like, they brought him from the G League as well, they made him what he was, like, the best fucking... But they paid him too much. And, uh, yeah, they paid him too much, but he fucked around, so they were like, get him out, you know what I mean? Even yeah. with LeBron, LeBron and, and Pat Riley bumped heads as well, and then really? Pat's like, let it, lets him go, any other team would do anything to keep him, Pat doesn't... He's like, well, it's Pat Riley, like, literally, in the meeting, when, uh, when Jimmy Butler was going there, Pat Riley just threw his rings... On the on the desk. What are you gonna say when you look at that <laughs> ring from, as a player, as a coach, and an executive? You're like, wow. Well, fuck. If I want to win, of course I'm coming here. And you get to live in South Beach. Also, you're gonna be in DJ Khaled music videos. But also, um, no state taxes, Florida. Ooh, that's a bonus. Ooh, and no COVID. You can get into Drake videos. You can get in Drake videos. Even Drake, than- even Drake's not in Drake videos. Justin Bieber was in his new pop star video. Fuck that. Even Drake doesn't want to be in them. So I reckon, I reckon if he's going to go anywhere, it'll be, it'll be, yeah, I'll stay in Milwaukee or he'll go the Heat. I don't see him going with Golden State. Do you see that? Mm, no, I don't think they play in a way that will facilitate him. Because they're playing through Steph, Steph and Clay, really. Okay, but I thought what he's going to do for next year is he's going to stay with the Supermax contract. Yeah. And then yeah, he's yeah. going to leave after that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. Okay. So, 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 so he's got nothing to do with Milwaukee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is like pre pre talk of him doing anything. Well, well no, I'm, I'm just trying to, I was trying to tie it in because has, you, has, you think he's trying to go to Canada. And we can't exactly talk about the Raptors because they're in Cancun now. <laughs> so I'm, like, I'm, I'm trying to make it as reliable, reliable as possible. No, 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 no. Like, Clippers are in Cancun. Oh, yeah, sorry, that's true. <laughs> uh, on the longest banana boat known to man. <laughs> No one on that boat is happy. <laughs> 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 Maybe Patrick Beverly because he just pushed Paul George off. <laughs> no, yeah, but Paul George got that knife. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yo, but if it weren't for Paul George, we wouldn't have the team name The Way Off Peas. So, what are you going to do? <laughs> the Way Off Peas. Remember when you hit that, the, you hit that one side, the side oh, of the backboard, yeah. you were like, oh, we are The Way Off Peas. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I called back. Yeah. Did you know why we call The Way Off Peas? No. No, 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 no. You still don't know? No. Okay, so Paul George was he plays the Clifford. His his rep, it, he was the um, he was called Playoff P this year, and apparently it was an old nickname. No, it's, it's a nickname from um, it's a nickname from I think when he went to OKC, and I think I well, think, what did he do there? I think Melo called him Playoff P. Ah, uh, okay, all right. Um, I could be wrong. But that's yeah, I mean. yeah. Okay, because I was going to say maybe in the Pacers days he was playoff team, but even then that was a team. It wasn't yeah. just him. Like they had a bunch of all stars. Roy Hibbert was a fucking poor man, all star and all that. Lance Stevenson. Lance Stevenson was an all star and that's going to be the dance. <laughs> blowing on. Have you ever seen that meme where where LeBron's getting blown on by a guy? Yeah. Have you not seen it? No. Oh, so there's one meme where Lance like in the middle of the game just. Starts blowing on LeBron in the middle of it, like just trying to get him in his head, and LeBron's like, "What? Like, like what the fuck's so going works. on?" Well, not really. Cause <laughs> he still won all the games, and LeBron yeah. dominated. But it just um, it made Lance famous, I guess. Didn't, didn't he try and uh, tie? Uh, was it untie someone's shoelaces at the free throw line? No, I, I believe that though for <laughs> sure, definitely. That's crazy. Yeah, he's just sad. Like, I feel like that's a foul. I mean, it's it's not a foul because it's it's, it's too stupid to even put in the rule book. <laughs> you're a grown man getting paid a hundred a million a year. You're not gonna like yeah. that's not, that's like somebody like you play defense. Play and you're like I've got your nose. You know what I mean? You're not gonna do it, are you? Really? Yeah, manipulating. Uh, manipulating exactly. his uniform. So, so, okay, so, so, so that he was called playoff P, and then he hit the backboard in one of the shots. Yeah, and it it, it did look good before they released it. So I'll give him that one. It did look good. And then somebody somebody called him way off P. And this was late so, in the game yeah. as well when there was yeah. a muscle in love. Yeah, because the Clippers blew a three-one lead. Again, mm. like fucking crazy. You know? uh, what did you What did you find? Did you find anything else out about watching us play, like rules wise or anything like that? Or... Um, because there was some fucking stupid rules, weren't there? Yeah, some of the three. I didn't know that you couldn't get fouled for uh for just like 
over exaggerating your falls. I didn't think you if somebody brushed up against you and you were like, oh my god, I, I thought that was illegal. Like, I don't know if illegal they're not gonna put you in basketball jail, but like at least foulable? Man, I'm already on the fire. Normally, that's called a flop in the NBA. Oh, fuck. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. It is called a flop, but it's like some like Marty Smart is like so good at it. And Chris like, Paul. Marty Smart is actually terrible and good at it. So they yeah, play that. Chris yeah. Paul is good. LeBron is good at it, but it's not really flopping. It's just like just exaggerating the contact. That's all it yeah. is. So that's part of like tricking the ref. That is part of the game. You know what I mean? Like James Harden. Makes no, no, no but I feel like it. there's exaggerating the con uh, the contact, but then there's over exaggerating the co- like the contact. Well, that's the thing. You gotta find the middle ground because because if if you under exaggerate, you might not get the foul. Yeah. If you over exaggerate, you're gonna get the foul on you. Yeah, 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 and, yeah. But but if you ooh sweep that middle, where's your ball left? Right here, right here, baby. That's the game right there. Game <laughs> one. one of the games where we got wild into the uh, the finals, Div two. I'm gonna say it <laughs> into, into the finals. Stop it for the hell. People need to know for the Hello uh, Kitty for the Asian fans watching. Um, we, we, we got wild card in the final because the whole team got tossed. One guy got a check. We got four. Two guys. Technical, the, two we got guys four technical it. free throws in a row. You realize now? Um, and there was uh, two free throws for unsportsmanlike conduct. Yeah. yeah. That was crazy. So the guy got, he got a tech roll, he got tossed. As he's on the bench, taking off his shoes to leave, he gets tossed out the gym. And then he, so he, he how many fouls okay, did he okay, okay. on that guy? So what happened, this guy started talking shit, right, to the ref. He gets thrown out of the game. So he's sitting there. He could have played the next game, but he started already unlacing his shoes, being like, he, like he knew he was leaving. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so he was unlacing it, talking more shit, because he knew he was going to get kicked right out. And the thing is, like, we were up maybe 5'10", but... It wasn't anything that they couldn't have come back from as well. Oh god, no. Oh, I mean, I we mean, were we gonna win the game, but it's like they could have, like, yeah, if they made some freeze or whatever, or something like that. I mean, we were gonna beat them, but yeah, like, yeah, you could have made it competitive. Yeah, or exactly. you made it angry. And is that the guy who, in the morning, you invited to be on the team? In the morning? No, 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 that wasn't him. No, no. Oh, okay, that was some other guy that that we know. Oh. Uh, I was like, oh, if I play, doesn't show. You can, you can show the guy with the big ass. Um, was a fucking round on the rebound, but no, it was not. It wasn't him. He was um, like they put put the had the unique stuff on, so it was like they were mates with the guy. It seemed to be they were mates with the guy running, and he was still tossing them. But then we just looked at the footage then, <laughs> and and the last one you get pushed for no reason. As soon as the whistle blows, yeah. you get pushed. No, there was and, there was there was. But before no. that, there's no contact with some of these props. You saw it. We watched it in slow motion. You all just start falling, and the guys just like, of course, the guys pissed off because he is flopping the whole game. But we're not seeing this. Oh, Nobody's man. seeing it. Oh, I'm watching ball. all of it. That's oh, crazy. I mean, like there was there was a little contact. <laughs> One of, one of them was like somebody opened this, the fire exit and the breeze came in. Like one of them was that. One of them was like a little bit of pollen. <laughs> Just hit you and you hate hey, fever sent me crazy. I do hate people. There you go. <laughs> Yeah, you were just the bag of the wind, and I was what? the kid from American Beauty just <laughs> filming you flying around. <laughs> like, biggest flop of the day, what you're after the yours was? Um, the one that you probably captured where it's like slow motion. Yeah. Because like, I was going across behind, and I was not sprinting, but I was going like, I, I, changed, I changed my acceleration. As that happened, I got chicken winged, and this guy was like a couple inches taller than me. Bigger guy. And yeah. I'm like 18. One kilo right now, and he would have been like 105, 110 kilos. So he's yeah. a lot bigger than me. So even like a little chicken wing, I would feel it. But like, I felt it, and I felt it like. And because you, because I accelerated at that point, you can see in the video it's just like me turning, and then my legs are like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sliding out of frame. <laughs> you fell over like shaft falls over down. Just, oh. <laughs> But no, that, that, that made him mad. Oh that yeah, because so after mad. that, then they started actually fouling you. Yeah, after that, they actually started hard fouling me. Well, yeah, first they tried to fight back with like them flopping, and then they're like, oh, that's not working. Let's make this a fucking game. <laughs> that one, that guy, that one guy that one, who flopped it was the weirdest one. Remember those things you used to get like a phase where it was a it was a person you push the bottom and his whole body would go <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. and then you'd let go and then come out with the string. That's what that guy did. As soon as Jamal, he didn't even back up. He just put the phone and like, the guy just collapsed. Yeah. <laughs> and Jamal just 
stepped up our lives and step over Leo. Just <laughs> <laughs> tell us what um because I don't know if Evan you heard this when he was telling us on the on the um, bench, which I found like interesting, but I mean I, like I'm, I'm I'm crazy, but like we're white dudes, so we'd never know. But tell us about what you said about the the calls with the hmm? you get less calls, you reckon? Oh, uh, I think that in Sydney. Um, and you can probably say Australia in general. Oh, I haven't really played around okay. Australia in competitions. Yeah, uh, I've only played in Sydney. Yeah, yeah. But I think that in Sydney, if you come from an African background, you are less likely to get calls. Really? Is it just assume you know how to play the game? Is, there's an assumption that you know how to play the game. There's an assumption that you're stronger, more athletic, and that you can control your body better. Really? So, yeah. If this is just what I have experienced. Maybe I'm, you know, pinch of salt. I could just be jaded. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> pinch of salt, pinch of pepper, <laughs> maybe spice. <laughs> but I'm going next door for a cup of salt. <laughs> <laughs> but, but yeah, like um, you, it's it's one of those things where I could be wrong. Yeah. But I feel that when I found someone on minimal contact, it's almost always caught. Cool. Whereas like even yesterday, I was pulling up for a shot and just like arms get slapped. Yeah, yeah, no, mm-hmm. no cool. And they're they're like clear. It's not even like it's in the body somewhere like when it's hitting your arm that's where the ref should be looking majority waist up really especially yeah. if you're shooting like that you know what i mean and then once you release you'll look at your feet because that's where you make sure you land properly or whatever but it's like they're the easiest fouls to call them you know what yeah. i mean because i mean normally you can hear it like if you hit flesh you can hear all of this shit you know what i mean so it's like, oh wait <laughs> Oh yes. <laughs> Sweet. So wait, wait, wait. You're not getting calls against you when people foul you. Yeah, that's yeah. what he's saying. Oh, yeah. okay. Not you getting calls for you hit getting somebody else. Oh no, that's a great thing. Uh, that, that, oh, that that's what I thought you were saying. That, I thought you no, said no, no, that no, you were getting no special way, treatment. No. No, 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 no. Oh, I, I, get, I get called against. Yeah. So, yeah. so if someone fouls me, it's I feel like it's less likely to get called. Oh shit. Really? Depending on the situation, but in in saying that, my game is a lot of fadeaways. Yeah. And that just gets called less in general. Like, if I went more to the ring and mm-hmm. got bumped, then I'd be more like, yeah, called. But to do that, I need to be way bigger physically, and I'm just not. Yeah, because, like, we, like if you're at the rim, then and you foul, you know, it doesn't go in, they'll probably give you it because you're like, well, that's got to go in. But if it's a fadeaway, it's like, well, you could have missed that anyway. Yeah, without yeah. the foul, because it's tough a shot. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I understand yeah. some of it, but yeah. I don't know. I don't know if it's true. Um, it's yeah. just like something I've experienced in Sydney. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna ask player the game from you, but I'll ask Evan first. Player, the, players of of the day. Do you remember any sick players that you players of on, the on, day. On video? It doesn't even have to be us. It can be the other team. Um, that one Spanish guy on that team oh, fucking carried that yeah. whole team. Oh, but you know what though? Dude, okay, the team of the day. I have to give it up for those old dudes. Oh, the youngest the, player was 49. The youngest player was 49. They all uh, played for, I guess, what, that YMCA? And they had the, fundament, they had the fundamentals out. Like, they knew exactly what they were doing. They had amazing passes, terrific shots. They were all balding and overweight. Yeah. Like, they just fucking killed it. Mid- mid-range kings. Yeah. Yeah, literally. Yeah. And they were like, they had the old man shot where they released it on the way down as well. <laughs> they, just, they, not, they can't even stay in the air long enough for a jump shot. And that was your team. Well, so that was my favorite. Well, and then there was the guy who dunked on you, what, twice? Well, he, he didn't dunk on you guys! He dunked next to us. He dunked next to us. So he that's great. And one of them, you stepped so far out of bounds yeah. to get in. Exactly. That's what. I was like, I was literally, I knew it was out of bounds because my foot was out of bounds when I was trying to stop him and yeah. he went round me. So I'm like, well, how the fuck do you do this? You know what I mean? Um, uh, hey, I almost, I almost drunk on someone. Oh, that that was gonna be my play. What did you say? You almost what? Drunk. 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 It's a throw dunk, so you don't touch the ring. I didn't touch. I wasn't close to the ring on that. Okay, is that the one where you fell backwards? No, no, that's the one where um I was driving right and he was on my left side. The um the wave guy. Off my pick. Okay, okay, okay. And then I kind of statue delivered it, and then as I was going up, I kind of tried to throw it in. Yeah. I got the height, but it just just rattled around and went out. There was also that one from the last game that was the, the little Asian dude who was filling in for their team. He was going for a shot. <laughs> you come up, smack the ball out of his hands, and just yell at his face. <laughs> this guy's three feet shorter than you, and you're like, fuck you! No, 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 no. Don't bring that weak shit in here! <laughs> you also told him to go back to where you came from, which I thought was a bit too. <laughs> <laughs> 
You gotta give the finger. You gotta give the finger. <laughs> the finger. Mutombo is the finger. No, no, no. Mutombo, Mutombo. <laughs> yeah, that was no. But after like, you, you saw the ref about the tech, tech run, you were like, oh, God, I want to mess with him. <laughs> no, 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 no. He said he, the ref was just like, we, we, like that's the warning. I was like, oh yeah, my bad. Yeah, yeah. 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 It was obviously you, you, it was a the big, it was a joke. It was, you know? Yeah, it was yeah. obviously a joke. But he still has to officiate. Yeah, of course. Yeah. But but easily the player of the game for your team was Will because he was just sinking those threes. Oh, it wasn't yeah, just that, man. It's but just he like, was great. It's like, for me, Will was... Um, he was like, the best like, athlete on the team as well. Oh, probably. Probably. Well, he's the best yeah. athlete. And he just had stamina. So, like, Will, <laughs> I feel bad a little bit. But because like, he's younger than us, like, well, I'm 27. What, you're like 29, Carl? Yeah. And he's 20. So, like, we, me and Carl are just like... That guy, that guy, that guy. <laughs> <laughs> well, we don't have to say that age. And he's now got nine fingers. Well, well I mean, I mean, Eden is just what what we will be in ten years time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> we were, I was getting roasted on my like, comments, and it's like, is that is your team one black guy and three gingers? <laughs> yeah, that's why we had to play inside. We <laughs> um, can't play in our dog comps. <laughs> but, but yo, uh, me and Carl were just like, all right, well. This guy is the one you have to put the clamps on. We don't have the stamina to, Pretty to, much, to yeah. defend him for a long he, amount we, of time. We literally, it was free and D. That's what he was. Yeah. It was just, and just that's free and D. Yeah. Yeah. No, you had, had, you had a great D game. Oh, I mean, that's that's my bread and butter. Yeah, you were phenomenal at D. Kyle, you were there. For, no, like, no, 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 no. Really good at just like being around and like Caruso doing no. stuff that doesn't show up with the statue. Yeah, and then, was I not? I was lighting it up from behind the arc though. Can we agree on this? Sure, you did good picks. That's your <laughs> You stood crazy. there and blocked other people with your body. I picked my nose once and I told you not to kill me when I'm on the bench, alright? <laughs> the best fronk. fronk? What's a fronk. famous fronk? I'm thinking of. Um, the most famous thronk, Dwight Howard. Don Don contest. Contest. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. So, so from the line, from sorry, he jumped from the three front line. His foot was just over it. Yeah. yeah. And like he didn't get close to the ring, but he got enough. Height. It was more. It was more. It, it was horizontal almost as well. Like his whole body was like this as well. Yeah, so that's what. Like he, he, he. What's it called? Talk shit. What, what's the thing when you move your body? Like, you can talk. Yeah, yeah. So like you get, you get, you get more points for talk in, yeah, yeah. in like the dumb contest. So like he was trying to make that as straight as possible. But then I don't know if he overshot it or what the fuck. Yeah, yeah, back then. yeah, yeah. So he just threw it down. Yeah. Cool. So it's like, it's kind of, I mean, and a few, Blake Griffin's had a few of them yeah. as well. And, the, and stuff, so but it's not Bla- Blake well. Griffin's had a couple uh, ladder thrunks in his early years at the Clippers. I'm, I'm loving the word thrunk. <laughs> 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 yeah, but I haven't used, I don't use it enough because yeah. I don't know if you realise, I'm not exactly thronking on people. <laughs> I'm finger rolling next to people. You know well, I, mean? I, haven't, I haven't dunked on someone for years, so it was even fun for me to even like get close to it. Mm. So, so it was, yeah, it was, it was, it, you, you almost dunked on two people and hit the back of the rim, I would say. Yeah, back, yeah. back to the rim, rim down. Yeah. They should let you guys have trampolines. <laughs> slam ball. Yo, I love slam ball. Slam ball was my game. Yeah, but yeah, you know, they can't get insurance for it anymore. <laughs> oh, yeah, because people died. Yeah, exactly. Wait, wait, what? Yeah, they jumped on the trampoline and necked themselves on the ring. Wait, wait, the professionals? Yeah. That's why it, never, that's why it stopped. Dude, it's a dangerous game. Yeah. yeah, it's crazy. But, I mean, there was so much padding on the rim. Still. I mean, it's... <laughs> when you're <laughs> jumping and flying up towards that thing? I well, know. that's his own fault for trying to go through it and back down <laughs> into it. We told him it couldn't be done before. He's trying to contort. Oh, yeah. no, you, haven't, you haven't seen that. You know, um, it would have it it been a Suns game and it was like the halftime show and they do like the dunks and stuff. Oh, yeah, there's, yeah. there's a video of this one of the um, the dunkers um, running up the court with the ball, jumps on the trampoline and he overshoots it <laughs> and his whole body goes through the rain. Yeah. So good. <laughs> with the ball or no? With the ball. Two points is two points. <laughs> That's my life. <laughs> That's my life. <laughs> two points is two points. That's my life. <laughs> oh, what else? What else? Um, yeah. So yeah, so what was it? So Will, absolutely fantastic. Especially yeah. considering he came, um, yeah. came in the day before. He went, when I, um, so I texted a, a, um, a group of ballers and I was like, yo, cool. can anyone come help me tomorrow? Do you have like a group chat of ballers? Oh, yeah, why not? <laughs> <laughs> um, so, yeah, did anyone help out? And then literally the first message was, we're all in the piss right now. <laughs> uh, yeah. And then Will was like, oh, I'll come down and see how it is. So, I don't know, like, I don't know if he slowed up his drinking or, like, I mean, he's 20, so what's the hangover? I mean, yeah, exactly. Like, Evie's probably having the spot last night, but and he's like, oh, sorry, I'm so tired. So, they've always just like, I've drank four Gatorades and there were six bananas. <laughs> 
Adam Hongover from last week, you foreign bastard. Yo, dude, um, I had a friend in marriage. Orange slices. Orange slices. It was cute. Well, shout out to the orange slices. There shout was, out to the orange slices. Two right. days later, dumped. <laughs> She wrote a joke on the on the ziplock. She wrote a joke and said, "How do you beat up an orange boxer? You beat him to the pulp or something like that." So she's bombing. <laughs> <laughs> she's bombing on orange slices. Let's change the subject. In that what case, did you call this? <laughs> what did you call this? <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. In that case, you guys will up and turn together and give her bombing. Um, I don't okay. think I've seen you crush her. That's so awful. <laughs> That's why we're a soulmate. Let's chase this up again. Yeah, group hug, group hug for Kyle. This is the only big free I know. <laughs> I'm gonna frunk on some pussy. <laughs> oh, oh, God. God. <laughs> I don't even know what that means. I think I'm uh, front seat. Throw your dick in a bus. Let me change the subject. Show yeah. the so man of the hard man of us. Crap check, crap check. Yeah. Oh, wait, yeah. Uh, we're right. the, oh, we're crap. We've got a second in the show. B ball shoes. Oh, uh, cool. Pardon twos, what I like to call the Palm Beach edition. I know what colours it is, but it just reminds me of like a beachy kind of thing. Palm, even no. even his shoes want to be in Palm Beach and not in Toronto. Nobody's got the No oh man, the, the, those shoes look like those Dixie cups you get at a dentist. <laughs> yeah, the backside? Yeah. Cool, but the but the peach man. Yeah, the peach is nice. Peach is sweet. Palm Beach. Yeah. It's an Andy Sandberg movie, baby. <laughs> Nobody's got those air Oz Oz into the stations. <laughs> At the station in Toronto, I'll let the record yeah, Good show. Um, Look at the CN Towers. What's up? Just really, really high tops. They go up to your shins. Oops. <laughs> no, what's that little hipster area of Toronto? That was kind of cool. Kensington Market. That was really nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And then really Austin Strip was pretty sweet. Yeah. Um, the Pie Place in Kensington. That's what I bought. I bought an Austin You know, Pie Minister? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pie yeah, 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 yeah. Otto's well. Berliner is also fucking amazing. Oh, little donors. I didn't go to the oh. But yeah, the Pie Place. Yeah, I talk Toronto food all day. I still have um, some uh, like maple syrup flavored papers from Kensington Market. <laughs> That's the ones that I rolled with. Yeah, they were there. Motherfucker, you cut the paper, like you cut the packaging for a roach. I have so much roach paper. Yeah, but you, see, you don't have to train The people who do, do that are so um, fucking disrespectful. Oh, calm down. I, I didn't know you'd been saving them for. I got this from Canada. Yeah, it's like a souvenir paper. You <laughs> ripped it for a roach? No, I mean, I cut it for a fucking roach. This. Why do you use the fucking paper package? Because that's what it's there for, really, no? No, no. you amateur. It ruins right. the paper oh, if you get rid of that little thing. Oh my lord, sorry, I owe you 50 cents. <laughs> Are you gonna go fly back to Canada and get him a souvenir in from his trip? Hey, that was two Canadian dollars. Oh, my bad. There you go. It's a toonie, baby. Oh, that's the price of inflation. A toonie? Love toonies. Is that what it's called? It's like a loonie, but two. <laughs> yeah, loonies oh, and yeah. Shout out to loonie. What was loonie's first name? I played for the Warriors. <laughs> No, no, man, just wave in weird ways. That's gonna be my end if I don't know, though. Put it in the comments. Kevin, 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 Kevin Looney. That was it, yeah. Kevin, Kevin Looney. Looney. He was one of the ugliest censors I've ever seen in my entire life, and I watched Shaq play for years. <laughs> so he must have been fucking ugly. Uh, what else we got next, you all? <laughs> we talked about Kyle getting broken up with. I know, that was on the schedule. Let's go back to Nick Rains. We've got the Great White Hope. <laughs> <laughs> we had One Man Gets Paid. We had Eden. Eden was the ghost in the post. And Will, who was replaced by my old friend Will, is a skinny 20 year old ginger lad whose nickname was the Fijian franchise <laughs> because that was my friend's old nickname. Um, I, 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 I want to mention one more thing about three and, and three. And then, of course, yep. Nick Ness. <laughs> so, one more thing about three and three. And that's Nick Nell Ness. That's this DQ game and just my trash talk. The what? The DQ game. Oh, yes. The uh, DQ. Disqualification. Yeah, 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 yeah. The Happy Feet comment. No, that wasn't me. Oh, that was me. No, but he was like just saying to his he was saying to his teammate, "Yo, we need some more movement." And then he got called for the travel, and I was like, "There's your movement right there, happy feet." <laughs> yeah, I remember. I remember. Uh, uh, what did I say? So, um, 
Wow, yeah, the guy was like chirping at you for uh, yeah, like the song. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I, I, I went into his ear and I was just like, man, you gotta stop paying me some rent. Wow. All that space I'm taking up in your head. <laughs> you said that to him? No, what you said before? That was the big boy. No, that was, that was, no, that was lost. You uh, whispered it to that him? That was the big boy. And that straight after that is when he started hitting me. <laughs> and then the last play... Um, How did they not wait the for The real surprise? estate that Jamal had in that guy's head. The, the team. <laughs> Oh, wow. And then the last play, um, yeah, so yeah. I'm top of the right key, I get the ball from Kyle, and I turn around on, over my right shoulder and fade away, swish. And then as I'm Fine. walking as I'm walking back to defend um, my big man, um, I whisper... My big man sounds so beautiful. <laughs> I whisper in his ear, um, like, you shouldn't bother to guard me, you can't guard me. Because he he had so much space away and he didn't put a hand up. Yeah. <laughs> and then after that, like I kinda put a little little hip on him, two hands in the back, high <laughs> second tech, disqualification. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy. I remember you told me you said that so I'm like, you you might as well not even guard me. That's <laughs> such a mean thing to say. In three on three. <laughs> oh yeah. When it's a camera rolling. <laughs> <laughs> It was literally like Jamal falling his mic up in the NBA. That's what he thought he was doing at that moment. Well, I love the other team, the team that got disqualified. He kept asking me, he's like, pull up the tape, pull up the tape, let's see it. Like, I did not want to show him because I know who was in the wrong. Yeah, no, he should have done that many last one. Like, there you go, just yeah, show him yeah. that seven times. <laughs> just show me, like, just show my legs in the air. I, 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 like, two weeks ago, I told um, some black dude to Google me. And then he asked me what I said, and I was like, oh, nothing. <laughs> Shit me straight away. I was like, yeah, that's right, Google me, bitch. And he's like, what? I was like, oh, now you go, baby. The man's close. Just bloody shot me, bitch. Lucky shot, that's all. Oh, um, anyhow. Um, so but anyway, long story short. So, NBA finals is a thing. It is a thing, and uh, I mean, it was a great thing until game three, quite frankly, because I had my schedule. Perfectly lined up with no gigs, so I can get hammered all fucking day tomorrow. Yeah, how much money did you lose yesterday? I mean, no, I only won. Tw- I only lost twenty five dollars. Well, we lost twenty five dollars each in the multi. But I needed oh, wait, Ron to get ten assists, which he didn't do. He had nine. What the fuck is going on? And then Rondo didn't even attempt the free. What four, four points? What, yeah, but he was stepping back freeze the last game. I should have put the money on Kuzma. He wasn't and stepping was... back. They were giving him so much space. Yeah, but he had like one step back, and it, and it looked so nice. I was like, what the fuck's going on here? I mean, like, I'm just sad it wasn't on TNT. <laughs> Why? T- TNT Jimmy. You can, uh, take, you can take Jimmy out of the TNT balls. You can't take the TNT balls out of Jimmy. <laughs> Jimmy G buckets. The G stands for going yes. home in five. <laughs> oh, oh, fuck you. Yo, what did I hear about Lakers fans trying to make sure Kuzma doesn't get a ring? Why? There's a, pedi- a petition going out that has, like, 10,000 sig- signatures. Yeah, the Man, Lakers want- fans are the worst. No, no offense. <laughs> what, what, what? <laughs> what, why? Cal Kuzma? Why? Yeah. I don't know, I just saw it like on a bar show. <laughs> oh, that it's because like, um, he, he did have a good game and uh, I think like... Oh, this is after game two, wasn't it? Yeah, no, yeah, game, game two, game, this game three, I think, right? No, game three, he played well. Like, I, I just oh. saw it posted like two. Oh, okay. so it's because, because Kuzma just went to the locker room first before anyone else. And that's as far as I know as all. Oh, uh, that's what. Well, it's the same with, with with LeBron kind of leaving as well. Yeah, you know but I mean, I mean LeBron went after him. But yeah, yeah. LeBron kind of thought the game was over, like didn't really register it. It was still going. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? Like he was like, oh, by the time I get near the tunnel, the the, the thing. Yeah, he, anyway. he walked off the court before the, yeah, the time yeah. expired. That's yeah. bad. Which yeah, no. I mean, just as a point of um. I mean, it's not Isaiah team. Thomas Pistons on the Bulls bad, <laughs> but it's still bad. I mean, what did Isaiah Thomas really do? I mean, it's just on the wall. No, he just refused to shake anybody's hand. Yeah. The whole team yeah, just but, walk off. But, but that's like a team thing. And that's what yeah. you do as a team. Especially, oh, especially, yeah. I remember that from the last dance. Yeah, yeah Especially yeah. if LeBron is the leader of that team. And he needs to bring people through, especially the younger players. Yeah. Um, you shouldn't act like that. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Oh, yeah, he's got a lead by example, for sure. Yeah. And, I, and I, I'm surprised that he hasn't witnessed it. He did apologise a bit during the press conference, but mm-hmm. he's probably tweeted about it as well, to be honest. Um, I mean, it was a hard loss for him, and Jimmy talked some shit to him at the end as well. Yo, they were, they were, fucking, they were going at it, they were yeah. piping up in, in, in the first quarter. Like, LeBron told them, watch out, we're coming. Yeah. And he came back, <laughs> so watch out, baby, we're coming. Yeah, yeah, that's what Jimmy said back to him at the end. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> 
He said what? He, he said something like that uh, yeah, at the yeah. beginning in the first yeah. quarter, and Jimmy said that like with two yeah. minutes to go. I mean, Jimmy, Jimmy. I mean, he's on fire, forty point triple double. I mean, that's like. I mean, LeBron's had a few, but not many people have done that. Like, that's fucking crazy. In the but, finals, but you're still reckon Lakers in five. What do I reckon Lakers in five? Yeah. I mean, if Jimmy goes off. I mean, like, the stars have to align for the Heat. Like, AD had a miserable game. Minus, Foul minus trouble, 26. Yeah, exactly, minus, yeah. no, minus 5 trouble, Minus 26. Like, he was leaky. Yeah, and, yeah. He's, and he's, like, a defensive player of the year candidate. So, yeah, yeah, that's yeah. probably not going to happen again. Yeah. Um, they're probably going to get Bam back at some point, so that'll be helpful. Yeah. Um, but I reckon the game... I reckon we go to 6, maybe 7. But I don't, I maybe 7? You're crazy. Definitely not 7. Don't. It makes a better game. I mean, like... More basketball's better, obviously. Yeah. I mean, like, you would need a Tyler Hero game. Yeah. You would need another Jimmy game. And you would need a Bam game. I mean, Bam is not going to come back 100% you, you anyway. Could, you could even have a Ke- uh, Kelly Olynyk game. Like, Kelly Olynyk has had a he game. He had his game. Celtic. He had 17 points. That was his game. <laughs> that was his game. <laughs> he's not having another game like that. I, he, like, if, if he's left open, he can make, like, six threes in a match. Yeah, but, but not with Bam. Like, he's, he's just getting more minutes because Bam's out. Yeah, yeah. Like, but so, he's so. making the most of his minutes. I like, mean, he is, though. Like, you, if, 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 when someone gets he's out... He's got that free and that up and under inside. That's, that's money, you know what I mean? Defensively, he's not as much of a liability as you would expect. My next point, LeBron, uh, next bet, LeBron on points. You can agree on that. LeBron's going to try and go for like fucking 40, 50 next game for sure. He's got to get at least 35 and 12 assists. Yeah, for sure. Depending. But he has to make up for the loss. To well, just swing momentum back. He needs to have a I mean, just for them to win, really. Like, yeah. And it's not like he had a bad game, although he had eight turnovers in that game three. Wow. I, compared to uh, well, and they have not like the other two games yeah, as well so yeah, 8 turnovers and 9 assists what was so, the final score yeah. uh, we lost by 11 oh. yeah um, and like the players were in at the end mm. like he said LeBron was walking off it's not like it wasn't like yeah. he played to the end of the game mm. like he still it's wanted like, to try and win it like. but it's like sometimes it can be weird though because remember Rockets game 1 and they literally Lakers literally gave up at the uh, with like the last three minutes of the game, and they could have come back and won it. But yeah, they just, yeah, they just yeah. didn't want to. Yeah, yeah. It's like we know we can, but like I mean, we know we could, but we. But yeah. we have games there. To but now on. in the finals, you can't afford to. Yeah, like, you've made it that far. Like, that's Do crazy. they make more money the more games they <laughs> play? No, no. The players no. make the same amount. Okay, the players make the same amount, but the, cost but the cost company cost. makes more. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, broadcast them. The more company does well, broadcast more, more and like. I guess during regular non-COVID times too, you're selling your tickets. Oh yeah. So to go to a game seven is better for the organization. Oh yeah, but the tickets, the the, the seat tickets are fuck all compared to the TV money. You know what I mean? It's like that doesn't even matter really. And like, but yeah, but it's still all the money that like uh, is. Westbrook's still getting paid the same as LeBron pretty much now, even though LeBron's in the finals and Westbrook is at home. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. yeah, um, What gives you some kind of? And and CP3 is getting paid more than all of them. (laughs) Which is crazy. Um, I, th- I, th- I, th- I think we're all done. You want to give me an idea of how I can... I've had LeBron... I've had, I haven't had you on the pod. I've had you on the pod before. Yeah. Well, I was and on the pod, but it was oh, like... Uh, at my house. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I need ideas how I can meet LeBron. How you can meet LeBron? Yeah. Um, First off, change the name of this podcast. <laughs> to what? To not... I want to meet LeBron James. That's fucking creepy as shit, man. It's looking like a stalker. All right. Is it? Yes! What it's the... It's the worst I idea. Why has nobody said this to me? I thought this was there. And if somebody was like, I want to meet the Kyle Lexi podcast. We're away from a podcast. No, podcast. man, it's going to sound like a little fucking No, 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 no. Yeah, and wait, I also... Wait, 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 wait. If the chance came up, you wouldn't? <laughs> Fuck LeBron James? <laughs> Probably not, man. <laughs> I mean, obviously, I definitely would. That's a game, but just... just, just you fucked LeBron? I'd probably swallow, because in my mind, it helped with my joke. You would suck. I don't know how it works. But yes, probably. You have to. He, he can't uh, wank, he's got no. four rings in, <laughs> in the way, you know what I mean? Like that Bow movie, like Mike, where he wears the shoes, but you're just wearing yeah. LeBron's dick in your mouth? Yeah, like dick. <laughs> That's lightweight, baby. Yeah, yeah, once he hears this, he's really going to want to meet you. Okay, so what should I change it to? Hey, um, hey, I just want to be friends with you. <laughs> no, hey, I'm not going to marry you in your sleep. <laughs> <laughs> See, here's what I think you have to do, man. You have to get, like, 50 times the following you have. Oh, yeah. You need fans. And, and then, and then, yeah. You need more than 70 people watching these videos. You hear that? Back home? Hey, uh. if each of you share this to five people, you will annoy five people. <laughs> <laughs> Good.
Get on. But please, share it because Kyle's a sad boy who got Shit. broken up with 45 Shut minutes up. ago. Now, I want to meet LeBron James podcast because I'm recently single and I've had a free time. <laughs> please share. Um, this will be plugged on Tinder. It'll be plugged on Bumble. It'll be plugged on Hinge. Born man gets paid Jamal Graham. No, Airball Jamal. Airball Jamal. Airball Jamal on, um, on Instagram. And, um, and you know, and Demaray from um, and my life. Life. And my bed. Um, Evan Comedy. Check him out. Thanks for tuning in. In a bit. <laughs> Lakers in five. Oh. Hey. Looking for M's like I lost a friend Jump out of my bed like where the bread You go hold the egg, wait to bring the check When we talk, we collision the car Keep us in your thoughts, fully dressed at the crack of dawn Weapons heading off, I can hear them from the block See them creeping through the fog Season's greetings, now feeding season can start Oh my god, look alive, looking like I live life on a crooked line Doing fine, you want maximum, stupid, I am the guy First of all, fuck the fucking law We is fucking raw, stay top top Oysters on the half jail, sweet shit ball Life a bitch and the push to feed Still fuck the wall, I'm a dog, I'm a dirty dog Ha 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 Oh dirty bastard, go in your jaw Shimmy shimmy y'all, got the semi in the hemi going